we're looking at Friends for Life, which is a competition that we hold annually now. Um, they're all people who have a special dog in their lives for a number of different reasons. That might be a, you know, an army dog, a police dog. It might be a dog that simply helps its owner physically in some way. And it is all about choosing a winner from five fabulous finalists. Well, he's not only my work partner, he's also my best friend. Um, and it's fantastic that I've got a job that's also my hobby. Um, we work together all day, I trust him 100%. Um, I hope he trusts me 100% as well. Um, and it's just a great partnership. To be honest, Peter Cross means the world to me because it just shows the public, you know, that the fire service has dogs. Not a lot of people realise the fire service have dogs. And it just highlights the great work that they do within the, indi within the individual fire and rescue services. I would hope her story does inspire others because it's not really medication to help with autism. Grace has moved on so much since she's had her dog trained in ways that we could never have hoped. We've now got hope for her future, which before we just we weren't sure that there was much of a future of independent living, but we've now got hope for that future. To have that recognised and something good to happen and if he thinks he's too damn difficult at the end would be something I can't put into words. I no, I haven't been depressed before and um, I'm expecting to spend lots of money on Kaiser. I'm sure he'll get totally ruined and spoiled. I'm just going to enjoy taking you in the atmosphere and seeing all the dogs, all the different shows and seeing what special things I can buy for him and different things. It's all about Kaiser, it's not about me, it's all about Kaiser. From a professional point of view, um, I'm constantly amazed and in awe of what my dog's capable of. Um, from a personal point of view, the uh, loyalty and trust that he's, he's got in me is quite humbling really and I in turn you know, trust him with my life every time we go to work and uh, it's a great honour to work with him, I love him to bits. Shirley's work is amazing what she does to help Rebecca who's only seven. It would mean a lot for Rebecca and Shirley to win. It would um, give Shirley some recognition for what the work she does to help Rebecca. She does save her life, which is really important for us. What would it mean for me to win? Well, it would be, first of all, it would be a great honour to win because I know there's a lot of dogs that do a lot of good work. And for Echo to be singled out as, like, you know, um, the winner would be, uh, be a fantastic achievement. We went last year just to have a look around and it was quite exciting. To win this competition would be a, a great honour uh, on behalf of all the uh, explosive search dogs that uh, I work with. But uh, there's a lot of really talented animals he's competing against. So, you know, so I think any of them would be a really worthy winner. Grace would very much like to win, wouldn't you? You're very excited about it, aren't you? And if I do win, I probably go and go around the room about 2,500 times.